Yo, yo, it's your boy, we fanned up 07. You not following the AFM, you probably gonna get hit by a truck coming up next month, man. Don't get me with your life, I'm out. Yo, you already know what it is. Hey, yo, what yeah. you saying? Wait up. They say I'm angry and shit. What? I say they hating and shit. Yo. You talking? You can't hear me? What the fuck? Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. We good? Yo, what's good, bro? I can't call it, man. I can't call it. My guy, been? QP, what up, Tayo? Chella, man, same thing, different day, man. Yo, um, so listen, number one, I pulled you up here for a reason, right? And it wasn't even just about woman of the year if you want to be all the way real with you, right? I used to think that you just straight ghost wrote for people. You know what I'm saying? It up and down. For some reason today, I was thinking of the people that your name has been tied to, the females specifically. I mean, that's what I'm talking about. That your name has been tied to. Yoshi, for instance. I feel like she was better after she met you, right? Mm -hmm. Bonnie. I felt like like Bonnie can freestyle, rebuttal, do everything right now. Like I feel like she got better after she met you, right? Right. I don't really know what was going on with you with Jazz, whatever the case may be, but you was in contact with Jazz, right? Mm -hmm. 40 bars. You, I guess, exchange energy. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. she's doing her thing. So look, now I look at it like this. Um, When you're exchanging energy, do you kind of show them a format to follow? And then from there, they, they, they just I kind of want to know that. Not like with, with, with them, because those are all people that would be great if they never met me at all. Like, they would still be great. So it's like those type of people, you got the whole bulk of what they're writing. So, like, how we do it in general now is, like, we all have iPhones. Typically, you won't even get a bitch in the circle. They got an Android. So if you got an iPhone, you share your notes. So whatever you wrote in bulk, I can see that. Then when I jump in your notes with these new updates and things, it's changed over the years, but whatever I'm working on, it'll highlight it in your note when you go in so you can see what I changed, what I've been working on, and then we'll, you know, where we're at type shit. So it's like it, the, the body of work is there. It's just like half thought out ideas, different schemes that you want to try to use that you don't want to sound a specific way using them. You want it to be natural. You want it to be like, that's what that's for. So it's like the bitch is already gold. She just going to go platinum. Like if she fuck with the right. And it don't even have to be a great writer like me. It could just be somebody that see the little minor nuances in your round and help you out to be like, hey, take this one word out right here. It could be a non-battle rap person. They'll tell you the keys to like the real success that you need because they are a consumer. They're the people that hear it and react versus you a battle rapper. You don't even react like how a fan do. Because you think as soon as you hear a bar, I could do it better than that motherfucker. But a fan, they don't have that, you know? It's just a natural, organic thing. So, yeah, the notes, the sharing of the notes, and then the, the, the shorty sending over her everything. So she got rounds where she got shit formulated. Then she has, like, the shit at the bottom of your note, which is, like, two bars, one bar, an idea. And those shits get formulated by the ghosts as far as, like, Taking it to the next level. So, you know what I mean? Okay. What up, Tayo? What up, Tayo? Anything for QP? How you feel about all of that? Nah, he was, he was on point with what he was saying. I mean, you know, I, I see a lot of people criticize the hustle about the uh, ghostwriter allegations. And I feel like at the end of the day, one, it wasn't 100% proof. And two, we've been seeing hustle put on for so long. Like, how can you deny it? Not to say she, people don't get help, even though they've been writers, and I'm sure writers get help and blah, 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 but we're not going to do that. She earned it. You know who my pick was? My pick was coffee, but at the end of the day, I'm not mad. She earned it. Okay. And you are definitely a, a coffee advocate, so for you to be saying that, it's like, it's kind of commendable, honestly. It's just like, oh, all right. But isn't I mean, it I said it on thought it, was gonna, like, you know, it came down to jazz and coffee the whole first year, it kind of seemed like, and then hustle comes through out of nowhere and wins it at the end. Isn't that what Rum Nitty did last year? He was all talking about uh what Suge and Swamp, I think. It was Suge Swamp. Think it was Shug, Shug you didn't really and, uh, hear Rum Nitty out there. You didn't really hear it. 
Yeah, yeah no. Impressive resume, but it was all friendly matches. You know, like in soccer, they got matches that don't necessarily count, even though you got Real Madrid versus, you know, the. it did. It doesn't matter if you motherfuckers ain't out there genuinely trying to kill each other. So it's like, I think with Hustle, she battled people. She was genuinely trying to get the fuck out of here with Jazz. She was battling her 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 cohorts. She was she was battling her, you know, like she has good rapport with all of those major niggas she battled. So it's like I think niggas discounted that. It's just like, bitch, we know you wrote with that nigga. Feel me? Like hustle got ghostwriting allegations, but but bitch, you wrote the battle with the niggas you battled. So what? You are not getting killed. Whoa, 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 whoa. How do you know that? How do you know that? How do you know that? I, listen, How do you know okay, that? Okay, so 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 real quick. Years ago, the same I way hustle people. hasn't been proven, that hasn't been proven either. I don't know where you're coming from with that. No worries, I'll, I'll clarify. So, just like I told people some years ago about how even your favorites, like they, they commingle, like they collaborate. Feel me? Like they coincide everything with the co to make shit the best that it is. Right? I told people that this was going on for years, and they're like, Nah, hell, nah, nah. Oh, you know, people like Hustle and Jazz, they would never. And it's like, no, these are the first people because they have the biggest fan base. They have the biggest following. They have the biggest amount of respect to where people will think that they're doing a service to you if they didn't give you this information or say, hey, you should rap about this or this is the angle you should take or, hey, instead of saying it like this, say it like this. That's battle rap. So I was just saying with her battling twerk, she's real close to twerk, like, extremely you know it's like with her battling any other nigga she battled who else is she battled um just so we can get a perspective on on when i say friendly match i mean friendly like i don't sense that it's hey jazzy please i don't sense that there's like blood finna be spilled when they battle so like that should tell you it's a friendlier mm-hmm. match it's like a um i don't know like when you who she, like battled? A, she battled a, a, rum lady she battled work let me see who she battled she battled Charlie Clips, she battled Loso, she battled Rum Nitty, she battled um, Big K and New Jersey Twerk. Now, Big K, right? That battle, she should, I like I like what she did, you know, hanging with, with Dude or whatever. But, like, you know, the Charlie Clips, the Twerks, the Rum Nitties, them is not. Well, hold on. Them no, niggas ain't fair, you, have, you have to give her extra props for the Loso battle. She took it on seven days. No- yeah, like five, yeah, seven, five days prep, seven days prep. Loso's the agate. <laughs> what? Right, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But um, nah, that's that's none of the but, names. But that was a one round of caps. It still was dope though. But it was a one right, round. The names y'all name though, yeah. Loso don't compare to the friendly fire names. So when I say twerk, uh-huh. nitty, right? Like the Loso, what? he's he's a legend, but it's not as legendary as them other niggas who he's <laughs> cool with. So you cool with these niggas? You didn't go in there. You know, I think Jazz collectively won those battles against them people, you know, overall or whatever. Um, but no, bitch, you're supposed to go out there like, you feel me? And get rid of, like, who, like how she got rid of Gaddis? Like that every time. That's that's Wody shit. Feel me? Hustle mm-hmm. out there rapping like a nigga. Every, and no pun intended. She out there rapping like a nigga, a gorilla. She own niggas. Like, for real rapping like how bitches can't. So it's like, yeah, give it to her. No friendly fire matches either. You feel I me? got a question for y'all. Um, they gave Hustle a lot of props for being the only female on a on on, on cards, such as uh, Homecoming, and there was another one. I forget the other one. You yeah. feel like uh, we should be giving Hustle props for being the only female on a, on a URL card, or, or should we be looking at the reverse and giving props to girls who was making names without being on a URL stage? And the girls that turned down the little ass bags that URL was offering, like, oh, no, I ain't going to be the only bitch on the card for that. No. So, yeah, um, it, it's a give and take with that. Like, you could, it's an uh, accolade and an accomplishment. But at the same time, it's like they would have, if you wasn't on there, it would have been a different bitch on there. For real. They would have just slid, slid her right in there. Token female battle rapper. But then, like, when they slide her in as a token, she actually be winning. So it's like she's not even just a token. She's taking, like, an opportunity, right, that... 10 out of 12 people would not get, and then she's actually maximizing it. Because we've seen a few, you know, where the girl be on the card and it's mostly niggas, but it's like they can't carry that weight. That bitch is a gorilla. Like, she got the BBL, but she's still a nigga. Y'all get that? Like, she she dolled herself up just so she could talk more like a nigga to you niggas. And she's out there <laughs> doing that shit. Like, yeah, until she like choked again. Coffee's, I feel like coffee's the same way. 
I like coffee. She's unorthodox. So it's coffee like her the same style. way. Coffee the same way. Yeah, her style's so unorthodox. It's like, damn, you tell me she got a ghostwriter. I'm gonna be like, where? How? She don't even rap like there's no blueprint to how she rap. Cause like when I came across Coffee's path, she was just like, Quantum, I'm scared of you. And I was like, Why are you scared of me for? Because I was like, the only thing I'm gonna do is try to link up with you, see what's going on with your with your rounds. And like before even like trying to smash or any of that nonsense, because that's nonsense. I'm going to be like how we could get coffee like to the top of the top of the top. You feel me? You're already up there. I'm trying to get you Mount Everest high. That's me. It's always been me, bro. When I meet the girls, that's what I always do. It's like if they could trust me not to think that I'm going to spill their tea, nigga, they will ascend. I'm talking about no names into the names that you hear right now. Like it's new names I can't even say because then you'll think, oh, he he helped ghost, right? He, he advised, he edit. I can't have that for the girls. But it's like girls right now, bitches you didn't know two, three years ago, you know them now these is my bitches like and it's like that shit is serious especially when everybody been doing it not talking about it like who see i just told you see you always wild in caps every time like it's a new <laughs> wave it's a new wave of shorties like listen and i'll I put you like this there's a new wave of shorties that's really like okay queen of the ring is dead but if they bring queen of the ring back and you see like a newish bitch that ain't a part of the old hags she's there if you look at the chrome 23 cards like these bitches be on those cards like they're, they're highly visible now. So they weren't mentioned two or three years ago. Now their names are in this shuffle, right? And that's how I like it to be. Chrome like, 23 cards? Chrome 23 cards, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And oh, you're talking about Yoshi. Yeah, no, that's cool. Yoshi. You're talking about Yoshi. Yeah, no, I'm not talking about Yoshi. No, Yoshi, no, no, she's already, man, what? She's already passed yeah, not everything we're talking about. So we're talking about girls just like literally this year. And you had a couple of them, like, I seen you interview them and, and, and talking and all that, but it's like, that ascension, bro, is everything when nobody talks about it, right? I nobody talks about I it. I interviewed them. Nobody talks about it, but you got to talk about it. There's people that say, hey, without this person, I wouldn't be here. Even though I'm the artist, I'm the popular, you know, I'm the one with the following. There's people in all those people's corner that make them the best person they are. Some people help them actually with the process and some people just exist. And knowing that person is breathing, it makes them. But most of the rest of us, it's it's I know a person that chimes in, chimes in on all of my body of work. And this person literally makes my shit that much better. And that's just it. So they don't have to accept it. I like it because the bitch still got to rap it. So whether she had a coach or not, like they got acting coaches, they got shooting coaches, coach. all of that shit. Does that mean niggas can shoot after you've been shown? No. Can you run faster after seeing a fucking 10, a 9, 6, 10, 100 meter dash? No, you can't run faster because I showed you how to do it. Don't mean you could do it. You got to be a track star. That's what, question. How come, how, you know, that's what question real talk. How come every time you talk about helping people, it's primarily females? You don't help. Nah, do you help the any niggas, males? The niggas, you know the niggas, no, the niggas that I help, which is a lot of niggas, like they're already on the, they're on the, they're already on that level. So it's more like I'm just booking every battle I can, and I'm hitting you up because it's like nigga, we're a circle of niggas that really write, and then you know, so like if a nigga go on tour, you see a nigga, this nigga versus hella niggas. What he, he not finna write all that shit by himself. That shit is getting passed out to the team. Like you feel me? I got this nigga coming up. Feel me? And that's a shared note. So, but that's not, that don't have to be talked about because niggas been writing together before the bitches came. Before bitches even came into battle rap, us niggas were writing together. Why? Because who else wants to hear this shit 24-7, seven, seven days a week? Not no working bitch. Not no bitch with a career. Uh, not no bitch with any type of real interest. This shit is made for like a specific type of fucking person. Right? And that's, that's, that's that. So salute, salute the niggas, salute the girls. But the girls climb faster than the niggas. So I don't. You work with niggas, they don't pay you. You know, they just expect you because you're God paying to just write the shit. And I do, because I like it. It's a passion. But the girls, they send food stamps. They send weed money. So I mean, they send back-end bread. They do all kind of shit to make sure a nigga's good because they have compassion. Battle rappers, we're so broke. I don't have nothing for you except an excuse or I owe you. You can write it down on a piece of paper. I get you next time. Or when they up my pay and then they up your pay, but it ain't what you really thought it was. And you can't, you know, it's not happening. Feel me? Anyways, that's regular shit, though. That makes sense. Regular Ooh. shit, bro. The what girls really, they're sure. like they are like baby moms that didn't fall out with you. Feel me? And then you're past the sex stage or the romance. We're not doing none of that. We're doing writing. My bitch Jazz, she's been with me nine years. She didn't see me go through a lot of girls and be like, 
At first, she would ask, you trying to fuck? You trying to... And then after a while, she was like, this nigga really not touching no battle rap pussy. Zero. Jazz was the only... Jazz the rapper was the only female pussy that I ever touched. So it's just like, damn, not even Yoshi's. Just Jazz. Because it, it was Jazz. Jazz is here. So it's the other Jazz. Jazz, he's the most famous battle rapper. I'm sorry. And I had to apologize for that. You feel me? But other than that, I don't... I don't you know, do a, I don't cavort with the girls like that. That's crazy. They, they're already crazy as it is. Feel me? To want to be a battle rapper? You're a crazy girl. You're a crazy female to wake up and say, oh, I want to be the best female battle rapper in the world. What? All right. Fuck with me. Let's get it. Let's 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 climb that path. Hey, over, thank you, thank over, you. Over. Somebody said something in the comments. That's a good question. Go sure, sure. No, I was going to say overall, did y'all, did, was y'all satisfied with the Wody, uh list? Uh, was he satisfied with the world's list? I guess, yeah, I'm not tripping over it to be honest with you. I felt like Jazz had funny battles. I'm just surprised, it's surprising how you hear certain names for the majority of the year, and then the end is not like neither one of them win that. It's just like kind of crazy. It, it shows you that you need to go hard every single battle. I don't feel like Jazz needed to battle Big K to be honest with you, and she lost that battle, in my opinion. You see what I'm saying? Man, she lost the, she lost the Big K. Battle. Huh? Yeah, I felt like she lost to Big K. Yeah, so Hustle said, fuck the big three. It's just big me. Thank you. So, I mean, <laughs> that's, what, that's what K do. You know what I'm saying? That's what he do to the whole John. Shout out Big K. Because Big K definitely had a Kendrick. Can Miss Hustle here. beat Big K? Can Miss Hustle beat Big K? Can Miss Hustle? She yeah, talk she like a nigga. Him. She the best she method him. bitches got. Because Big K, the way he talks. Can Miss Hustle like, beat Big K? I don't care if she told like a nigga. Can she actually yes, beat Big K? Yes. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm saying she's one of the few that could probably get the job done. They probably won't, but she could. Yeah, probably won't. I wouldn't bet on her, but she could yeah. definitely do it. Yeah. Okay. She can get out there okay. and get. We are a black culture. If you try to really use that without being too racy. That shit, and you a bitch, you could take that wave with you. But like, who this white boy think he is? I don't give a fuck about your family. You feel me? You're not a hustle rap. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would just be a dream yeah, yeah, to, yeah, to, yeah. to, to do. Okay. Okay. She called him out on K. Twitter. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. I seen, I seen she called him out. Do y'all feel like Coffee Brown could be Big K? Ooh. I, I mean, Coffee, Coffee's... <sighs> I, I feel it. like she, she could. Beat hustle. Didn't she be hustle? It got it got ended it ended before we could see the end because all the I, fighting. But she was banging with hustle the whole time. She was like, banging, yeah. Like, I'm yes. rapping, bitch, like feel yes. me. She was like, banging. Like, the hustle tactic in the middle of the battle because the bitch was really rapping, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. nah. Coffee could. It's just it would have to be the best coffee, nigga. We're not talking no Starbucks, no Seattle's best, nigga. None of that shit. It's got to be the best coffee. This shit ain't even on the shelf. That's what that would have to be, or Big K is gonna do what he the, does. The T top coffee, the T top coffee, T top coffee was rare, it was dope. Um, nobody was left off the list to you, right? Um, left off the list. Ooh. Uh, uh. If a female was left off the list, the way they talk, we would have heard it. I can't you know, believe I, I wasn't. I'm like Vixen, I'm gonna say this Vixen. though. I thought they rated Shayna too high, not because she didn't deserve it. Her rounds was perfect. I just didn't feel like it was enough work. <laughs> it was basically one and a half battles. She said she had another battle that nobody knew about, so I can't speak to that. But it was basically a battle <laughs> where um the other girl didn't yeah, rap. She said it dropped. <laughs> so I mean, is that I mean, enough is that work? No, no, I'm not saying it's a fault. I'm just saying is that enough work? I mean, it is the criteria, I think was. I think the criteria was two battles. But then that Tory Doe battle was like a cipher. It's basically like spitting a verse, like I don't wasn't really no, you know what I mean? But I, salute I to her though. She definitely she definitely had bars. I definitely people seeing uh saying Jay. See, my thing about it is I ain't gonna lie, sit here a lot of y'all. I don't know all the females, their entire resume for the year of last year. You see what I'm saying? So I ain't trying to even jump out there like. I see people saying Tori Doe, I see Jade, Shana yeah, Chris, had Chris P, Chris P, yeah, I'll Chris P said Spencer. that uh, she thirty the dude named King Leo. So if she thirty them, then I right, that's cool. Then that, that, that that's cool because she definitely had fire material. But, but his you thing know. about it, it's cool. But at the same time, when it goes down to the strength of schedule, 
I guess King or uh, uh, caliber of opponent, King Leo's going to be the only. I'm saying it's going to be non-existent yeah. basically there. So it's still going to be yeah, going to allow because it was Leo. So, how much did the Wody win? Wody, how much the Woman of the Year win? Cash. Uh, I think he said it's like eight thousand and change right now. But you know they take the donations all the way up until the uh, even watch during the ceremony. So for contrast, I think Big K went into go get his belt. It was like forty eight hundred, and when he left, it was like sixty six hundred or something like mm. that. That's what Big K took on. The yeah. media said ten so, K so, is at ten K right now. What, what, yeah, what but they take hustle? They, she get? hustle get eight thousand. They're gonna give out five hundred dollars to each of the uh, extra awards, like best round, best battle, rookie of the year. So out okay. of that ten thousand and change, yeah. they're gonna take out about twenty five hundred or four or something like that, like two thousand, something like that. Mm-hmm. It's still more than the dudes, from what I'm, <clears throat> from my understanding. So oh I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. That was my ask shot. That why y'all. I mean, they definitely, this is the second year in a row they done put up more uh, money than the dudes. And I feel like this was way more exciting than the dudes. Yeah, plus I want to see another $8,000 going to her body anyway. So I voted on that. Like, that's what I voted on. <laughs> like, she already invested. This is a double investment. We doubling back so she don't end up with a double back. You feel me? You know I mean, girls got BBLs and then can't afford to maintenance them. And then it turns into what? <laughs> Michelin man, you know, I'm tired of seeing it. The mascot of, you know, I can't do it. I won't do it. Salute, salute hustle. Invest, baby. Please invest. What y'all thought about what uh, Shuni and uh, Lola was going back and forth about? I Shuni heard and who? Shuni and Lola, they was basically, well, go ahead, Caps, because you said it best on your uh, on your blog. What? Who's part? Shuni and Lola arguing man- about the, the chokes, the chokes. The only thing about it, I- I'm a, nah, I just I feel like this, right? You know what I'm saying? I feel like Lola is right. Chokes, chokes is, is chokes. It stumbles, mess ups, bringing it back. Da 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 da. Anything that's not clean, that falls under a choke category, whether you like it or not. You can't stumble two, three times, and because you got it back, we don't count it as a choke. Like like things have to change with that situation right there. But if Shuni had seven battles, and out of seven battles, five of them were not flawless. <laughs> I don't even know what I even arguing over, to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? That doesn't make any sense to me. Now, I see what Shuni is saying. She's just like, oh, but you being extra with it. And they had got off of me and you brought me right back up. I seen when she said she an effing rookie, you know. I seen all of that. I seen all of that. But at the end of the day, I feel like Shuni, if you're not messing up in these battles, she can't bring that up. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about the comments. No, no, you know, you know, don't worry about the comments. No, I, caps. You know, I'm used to this. I, you know, I love it. You know, I'm in the chat. Magneto, all kinds of things. I'm sitting here looking at like, yeah, this thing is crazy. Caps, you know, I love this shit. You know, listen. You know, that's that's you know the chat gun chat. That's my chat. But uh, what I was gonna say was only thing that Lola I was disagreeing with her. She called everything a choke that wasn't a choke. She called like uh bringing it back a choke. She called like, you know, niggas be glitching. I don't even like that either, but it's not a choke. You got to have a differentiation. Nah, but what she said, though, to be fair, though, she said when she was talking about choke, she mentioned what you just said and said she puts all of that under one category. If you mess up in a round, it stands out. Now, if you did it one time, all right, but if you're doing it two, three times, I mean, bro, you got to take points away from that, bro. You have to. You have to. I don't see how you can get performance if you're doing that in the battle. I don't see how you can get, you know what I'm saying? That I, I think choking no, and messing you, up falls under different categories, honestly. But if somebody don't know, they're going to be like, Chuni choked five out of seven battles? That sounds crazy. But if you go back and be like, well, she didn't yes. actually choke. You know, it, it, I'm just saying it did sound it did sound exaggerated. That's all I'm saying. Mm. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So you feel like Is even though she night? said... Called bring it back some talking about stutters and all of that. Even though she said that, you still feel like you said you choked at a five five out of seven battle. Like you shouldn't have said it like that. You just said you choked in I don't know two three and then you. Well, she just said she wasn't clean. She could just say she wasn't clean in, in five out of seven battles, and that'd be the point. When you say it over and over, and I and I agree with Lola too, but I I can see why Shuni, uh, 
I can see why she took offense. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, I watched that whole thing. She definitely uh. Wrong though. She long? Was she wrong? No, no, she wasn't wrong. She wasn't wrong. She was not wrong. And you made a good point about how choking does influence all a lot of those categories. Yeah, it does, bro. It does. I don't like memorable flinching. moments, nigga. I'm gonna remember you choking that battle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't like when niggas be glitching lately. I I seem like it'd be more to, more than ever. I remember like niggas like you know what I'm trying to say. Who did it recently? It was definitely on the card that Hustle was on and chest choke. Where, where they like they spit and they're not choking, but they like it's like they like they they rant like they saying their words over like they like yo, but hold up like like it just be like it's like they glitching. I don't like that, and it seems like niggas doing it more more now than I ever remember them doing it. Bro, you got to do it a lot. These niggas are battling. Oh, bro, and I always say it, and I oh I don't see no one else really bring that up. I always have said that, like, bro, you be stuttering and bringing it back, you know, like it's not clean. That shit is not clean. It's not bro. clean. Yeah, it's not clean. It's That's not, not clean. clean. It's not clean. That's yeah. what I was saying, well, see, not. Get you an easy battle. I thought they was both kind of doing it. But yeah, doing that, that was a, that too. was a, yeah, that was a glitchy. That was a uh, bro, that bro, was definitely bro, a glitchy. Though. You know why? Tay, Tay Rock is not doing that. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, you're right. Tay Rock yeah, yeah, you right. Jazz, you're right. Uh, uh, like a lot of the top bad rappers really ain't doing that. Trez ain't doing that. Like we can't ignore that if you keep doing it continuously through the round. Now it has to be bought. It has to be bought up. You see what I'm saying? In my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I agree. But, I, I definitely agree. Man, man. Did you get your predictions for Civil War Two yet? Uh, I think I talked about it real quick yesterday. We, we could do them right now. All right, Civil War. The I know the under the bottom started with franchise so I think Franch versus is it French? Franchise Hansel. versus Hansel. I like franchise. I think franchise is underrated, but I understand why. Because sometimes it could come off as a. Uh, sometimes it, you know, it could come off like generic. But I think he definitely got the aggression, and he definitely be having a haymaker around. It seemed like a like a real room shaker around. I like franchise. I like franchise over handsome. Okay. Wait. 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 You say style could be like considered generic, maybe? No, I've heard critiques of, of franchise, and I can't deny that sometimes they do come off just like generic. Like, like I, I get, I get the criticisms. I personally think though that he's underrated because I think he, he, he. Uh, I feel like he always comes prepared. I don't remember ever seeing him choke. I think he choked once, maybe. But either way, he always. Yo, I, he, he, I feel like he. Is Yo, my fault. I think Franchise is the Canadian Tay Rock. At one point, Rock and uh, Franchise was almost identical with their style and whatnot. So, yeah, I don't know about generic. Yeah. If that's the case, you would say, well, Gun Bars are generic, and then you would look at Tay Rock. I mean, that's kind of so, a lane he pioneered, but I get what you're saying. But no, I'm just saying that I'm just trying to be uh, fair in like my assessment. I'm saying I've heard that, and I could I could understand that yeah. to a point. Like a nigga like Cuban Franchise, some of them get lumped together a lot of times. But I think franchise is, is talented, and I, I think he's gonna. Uh, I don't. I'm not as familiar with Hansel off the top either. I'm. I'm gonna be very transparent. I've seen some of his battles, but uh, Hansel. I would. I would. Yeah, I, I liked what I saw, but I haven't seen a lot of Hansel. But I like franchise to win this, from what I know. Yeah, I got franchise in this one. To toss. Let me, let me pull the card real quick. I got franchise winning this one. Um, what's the next one? What's the next one? What's the next one? It was Jack Boy Main. Versus Klutz. What's your thoughts on that one? I wouldn't Jack be surprised Boy if Maine. Jack Boy wins. I would not be surprised if Jack Boy wins. But let me ask you this: Who's the underdog in that in that matchup? Yo, I was going to ask you saying that right there. I would. Um, you think? Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. You think Jack I Boy said I wouldn't underdog? be surprised if Jack Boy wins, but who's the underdog in this matchup? Because I feel like Klutz is the overdog. I feel like he's the overdog. How? How? I feel like people think Klutz is a better battle rapper than Jack Boy Maine. 
what the chat say. I've never I feel like people feel like I've never heard it before. I'm, what I'm saying is, I feel like, like people give Klutz that. more. All right, well, who the better battle rapper, Jack Boy Man or Klutz? I think Klutz is. I still say Jack Boy. Okay. Jack Boy been through high. Jack Boy been through low. Jack Boy didn't battle top league. Jack Boy didn't battle small yep. league. Jack Boy didn't hit stages. Yep. Jack Boy didn't did it all. Yeah. So, and, and more still, experienced. And it still stayed around the mix. Still around the mix. Look at Kid Chaos. I don't know where the fuck he at. Look at us. Uh, some of these niggas are not existing in all reality. They don't know how to So we both mix. agree. Jack Boy's always. We both, we both agree Jack Boy more experienced. But is Klutz better? As a, is he, is he got better skill set or no? I got Jack Boy, I think, man. I got Jack Boy. I got Jack Boy. Clutch still got to prove. Like, he's cool right. from what I've seen. Right. He's, I mean, all around, he said all, like, come on, bro. Just skill. Like, like I feel like, I feel like, I'm going to pick Jack Boy. Let me say that. I'm going to pick Jack Boy, but I wouldn't be surprised if, I don't know what people have been saying because I just seen the card today, uh, yesterday, but I wouldn't be surprised if people feel like Clutch is the better battle rapper. I feel like people this. rate Klutz high. I, I, do you not hear? I always hear positive things about Klutz. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Who's on the, who's like big on the stage? All right, boom. I'm going to ask you a question, right? Mm. You talking about skill wise? Skill wise. Right? Right. If it was if it's all about skill and you put Hitman Holler and you put quantum physics. In a small room situation, and nobody's there, and it's skill on skill, and they're rapping. Who wins that battle? I see what you're saying. If it's if it's if it's, I'm not going to downplay Hitman though, because Hitman got a different set of skills. But I get what you get. I get what you're getting at. You're saying QP got the better pin, quote unquote, better pin. He should win in a small room setting. But you're right. Hitman do a lot of things, and that's no walking apart for QP. I agree. That's why I got Jack Boy when I think he's more experienced. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying, I all I, I never heard too much criticism of Klutz, is all I'm saying. I never heard nobody say, like, oh, that nigga whack, or oh, that nigga did They always say, except that he inexperienced. I mean, Klutz is like, yeah, we'll see what's up, man. We'll see. We'll see. Clutch, will, his help, I mean, will his help Klutz if he beat sure what's going on. If he beat Jack Boy, huh? will his help elevate Klutz? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. The question is this. The question is how much elevation is it going to lift them if they're on the app and it's not dropping on YouTube? Yeah, that's a, that's that's the constant question. That's the main question right there, bro. You got to under, understand, I interviewed Kid Chaos, right? Mm -hmm. Kid Chaos was like, yo, I'm the only battle rapper on the app who doesn't have a YouTube drop. I've never hit that platform with over a million followers and I don't hear nothing about him, and I think he's dope. I think he's dope, but I definitely see the difference where it's like, whoa, the people who was who hit the YouTube platform, y'all fan base is way bigger, bro, than versus the people on who never hit it and shit like that. All right, yeah, you're right. I mean, Kid Chaos is dope, and you're right. You're absolutely right. Definitely right. All right, yo, I, that's just me. That's just me. What's the next battle? That's not on the see people now and people. Uh, all right, so we got franchise and Hansel. We got Jack Boy Main and Klutz. We got Danny Myers and Authentic. Danny. Danny thirty. I think so too. However, hold on. However, I think Authentic is dope. I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. I think he's dope. Define you don't dope. like him? He's from. Him. I know, I know. Right. I'm not disrespecting him. I, dope. I think he. I think he's service. I think he's middle of the road. Yeah, yeah. He, right. he cool. Hmm. He cool. He cool. Yeah, he's. I mean, he's bro. I'm not gonna beat Danny Myers, but. There's certain battles that when you look at, you already know they're not going to win. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I'm surprised Danny's taking this battle. I think it's retarded in all reality that he took this battle. Like, what do you gain out of this battle? 
Besides, I'm not even mad Ray, anymore. He, you know, I'm not even mad anymore. I, I expect it with Danny. Danny gonna battle whoever they try in front of him. Yeah. I don't talk about it no more. This is what he gonna do. Like he, then he gonna try to talk you into why it makes sense. And it's like, all right, whatever, bro. It's gonna wind up debatable, which is gonna lower your stock. You know what I'm saying? Because you shouldn't be having no debatable with this nigga to begin with. You shouldn't even been battling him to begin with. You sitting sure. here saying you want Lux, but now you're battling authentic. They wouldn't even. They would dare to call Lux with that name. You know what I'm saying? Not only did they call you, you accepted it. So it's just like I don't know, whatever, bro. Um, Danny Mai's authentic. I got Danny. So flow. Uh, so Flair Soul and Kid Slade. I like this. Now we've been agreeing on all our picks, but I feel like we're gonna disagree nah. here. So I'm gonna I'm gonna cut to the chase and say Kid Slade. Okay. Okay. Why you say that? Kid Slade is dope. I know all the controversy and, and he shouldn't have went to court. Yada yada yada. Kid Slade is dope. Kid Slade is very dope. Mm -hmm. That's somebody that's dope. That's why I don't like calling everybody dope. Like when you say authentic is dope. Authentic is not Kid Slade. No disrespect to Authentic. Not saying he want to be Kid Slade. I'm just saying oh. Kid Slade is is fire to me. Kid Slade is fire. Yeah. Yep. All right. So you got so yeah. you got Kid Slade, Slade Soul. Who you got? That's cool. I, I like I like. I mean, he's cool. But like, I would rock with Kid Slade style too. So I don't think we're gonna disagree on this one to be real sure. I think he's I think, I, think I think it's a good matchup. I think it's a good matchup. I think it's a good matchup. Now, so Flair's haymakers, of course. Yep. But I think Slade is fire, is what I'm saying. It's a different me too. Me too. Me so too. I, got, I got Slade myself. And then you got what you think about that one. Coffee Brown versus Arsenal, you said? Oh, yeah. That's what you said. That's what you said. Yeah, because it broke up. I mean, I'm not going against you Jersey. Going. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going. To, I got Arsenal. You got Arsenal Jersey. Coffee? Yes, big Jersey, bro. You big nine seven three two. Danny Myers over authentic. authentic is, that's where authentic is from. He from Newark. Authentic, not from Newark. Oh, you contradict this stuff now, bro. Not we. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Let's be clear. Let's be clear. One, authentic, not from Newark, but I salute him for being from Jersey. I didn't give him no slander. I didn't give him no slander. Two, Arsenal is from my hood. He from my city. Like, and Arsenal a legend. And I like coffee. You know, I like coffee. But I'm going with Ars. Got to go with Ars. Got to go with Ars. But okay, now if you had just said all of that. Cool. You said I ain't going against Jersey, and all I'm saying is authentic is from Jersey. So if I that's said now I'm going against Big Jersey. Beating Danny. I don't have him beating Danny. Thank I got to be know, realistic bro. at the same time. But I'm just saying Arsenal is a legend. He from the he from the town. He from the yeah. gang. He from the hood. Nah, we're not doing that. We're not doing. And keeping it real, all right? Let's let's get past the biasness. Let's get past the biasness. Arsenal is a dangerous opponent because Arsenal will turn up. He'll be bad in one battle, good in another battle. It's he it, it could he could go in there and drop the ball. I ain't gonna lie, but I don't think after what happened with Hustle, I think he's gonna go in there and be. It, it, I, I think he's gonna have a point to prove. I think it's a bad time for Coffee to take. Or anybody taking Arsenal after this quote unquote Hustle loss, I think. I think uh -huh. Um, man, that's a good battle right there. I kind of feel like I ain't going front. Who, who you got? I ain't going to front. That's a good man. Uh, three rounds, Arsenal and Coffee Brown. I mean, Arsenal has the ability to clearly beat it to be real true, but I think Coffee's like in a zone right now, too, to be real true. And I love Coffee. Number two, probably like it's showing that, you know what I'm saying, what her hard work is paying off. I kind of feel like at the same time, and yeah. she wants the Jazz battles. She ain't going to play no games for Arsenal, bro. She ain't gonna play against Arsenal. So it really to me, it really come down to ours. Is he gonna be a hundred percent or not? Because I think she is. And that's where it gets tricky at with ours. So, but well, all that said, I like ours. I got ours. <laughs> he's doing enough for me. He's doing enough for me. But it's just like, oh, okay. He's 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 still getting crazy. He's still he getting is. crazy. 
People uh, forget Austin. that that first round. No, no, no. People forget that first round versus Hustle. He was cooking. He just choked. People act like he choked and was terrible. No, he was cooking that first round. But then he choked. And then Hustle just said, fuck that, which was dope of her. Salute to her. She did the right thing. That's old school rules. But it wasn't like he was trashed that first round. And he took the second round. I don't care what y'all say. After niggas' memories start changing. Oh. She dirty them and all. Arsenal was fire in that Hustle battle them first two rounds. He choked. Okay, That's his bad. Right. You know what? I'm wrong. They say I see the chat saying authentic is from Long Island. All right, my fault, my fault. I thought it was Jersey. No, I, I think he is he from Long Island? I think he started battling in Jersey. I thought he was from somewhere in South Jersey, but you might be right. He might be from Long Island. So even more better. All right, so good. Hustle. I'm gonna say hustle. Uh, Coffee Brown and Art is gonna be a good battle, though. It's gonna be a good battle. It's gonna be a good battle. It's gonna be a good battle. I'll tell you this. Not to get ah, too you early, know what, bro. What? What are you gonna say? Now that I'm thinking about it. Now that I'm thinking about it. Now that I'm thinking about it. I might low key go with coffee. <laughs> I know coffee gonna show up. I know coffee gonna show up. I know she's not gonna get up there and, and and possibly choke or. I don't really gotta worry about that one, to be honest with you, bro. Ours, I don't know. Nigga might lose. We might stumble, not stumble, but lose. Because I've seen Arsenal in plenty of battles lose, lose his train of thought. You can kind of clearly tell and start freestyling. Mm -hmm. I don't got to mm -hmm. worry about Coffee might get this. I think Coffee might get this. It should be a good battle. Yeah, I think Coffee might get this. Yeah. It should be a good yeah. battle. Yeah, I definitely want to see it. You know what I'm saying? But. No, the card is okay. The card is so-so. So, yeah, the card is... I mean, listen. This is the type of card that it could end up being better than look on paper. Yeah, but at the same time, be with, with ARP not doing max outs in the blue rooms and all of that, like, you might want to start focusing on, you know what I'm saying, battles that people want to see at this point. I wanted, I generally want to see Hustle and Jazz in the rematch. You know what I'm saying? Let's I'll, not wait two, yeah. three, four years. Big K and Tab still didn't happen. Before that, it was supposed to be Big K and Tay Rock. Everybody wanted to see. And we, wait, we waited years for certain matchups that I feel like we shouldn't have even waited for. And so with them, right. your main opposition out of the way, that back, you know what I'm saying? I feel like you should start snatching up battles that people want to see. If you want to get it's back loaded. that realm you had all this time. Yeah. You know? They yeah. still have it, though. They still have it, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, there's some battles. I mean, there's some, there's some, there's some. I definitely want to see the Jazz and um, Hustle rematch. I didn't at first. I used to be like, I don't like rematches, but now I do want to see it, and I definitely want to see Coffee and Jazz. And one yeah. day maybe I would like yeah. to see Coffee and Hustle, but I know that probably won't happen. Yeah, I was going to say that. I was going to say that. Now it depends on all the goals because Jazz is talking about tell Hustle to bring the Woody belt out. Like, whoa, y'all battling for the belt? Nice. Hey, hold up, Coffee got a belt now. Yeah, coffee got now, a belt. Also, if you beat Jazz and you take the belt, turn around and actually battle coffee again and really try to beat it for the belt, if that's an option, too. So now I got all the Boldy belts. That's big sense. Yeah, except big. <laughs> nah, that'd be I dope. Think... I mean, I... that'd be dope. That'd be dope. I like coffee year this year, by the way. Got... She's starting Keep off strong. Yeah, coffee is. She is. She is. She is. She is. E heart Arsenal. But we're gonna see. Uh, she, got, she got Arsenal. Yeah, she got. Yeah, she got. Yeah, we're gonna see. It's a good start. Look at this nigga, Lux the Goat three one three. I love Lux and I love Detroit. Like he trying to flame me. He trying to wild me up. <laughs> you know what? Um, now the question is. Oh, all right, boom. <laughs> I would definitely be down for that. I would definitely be down to the, uh, I'm, I'm not really big on rematch myself. I think Shawty Power and Arsenal, I don't know why they rematched it. They tried to make right. the first battle that had wild views. And that didn't Charlie Clips right. and Tay Rock, I kind of felt like, all right, 
Number one, I felt like Tayrod's second and third round wasn't bad. I want to be clear about that. I've always said that. It just wasn't as good as Charlie Cliff, and he looked like he, he basically destroyed you. You know what I'm saying? But his second right. and third wasn't bad. So when Cliff gave him the rematch, it was like, eh, all right, Tayrock is putting in work. You want to give him some, you know what I'm saying? It was just, all right, whatever. I'm not going to not watch the battle. But hustling jazz is totally different, I feel like. Just because yeah. y'all edited it was that happened, whether it was a choke or it was a stumble or a stutter or whatever, but y'all edited it out. So we really don't know who wins because we know when that happened. If it's a choke that round, she knows. I don't know if you were saving her or I don't know. I don't know. So I want to see it now. And on top of that, I feel like everybody in the comments is saying Jazz would definitely clearly beat Hustle. I don't really believe that. I just don't, I don't know, that. man. Jazz, Jazz be knowing how to win. To be. Jazz be winning against these women. And she went against men too. Don't get me wrong. She no, Jazz has the angle. I think she got enough history and angles on hustle. Hey, listen, hustle tough though. Hustle, hustle is tough. I want to see it. It's gonna be a good match. Mm-hmm. Hustle tough. No, that's a fact. That's a fact. So, I don't know. But I right, look, 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 You know what? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's already been involved. I don't know. I'm salute. I salute. You, you heard, Joe? Always good to see you. Salute to the chat. They wild me up again. Next time we're something more outrageous. I'm out of here, Caps. Yo, easy, bro. <laughs> yo, let's take a look like Sub-Zero and shit. This nigga, <laughs> yo, you 